You brought up the police <clears throat> in your speech a few times. Um, so what is your, like, what is your main concern? Since, I mean, About, honestly, the whole reason police, yeah. uh, I mean, it, it, it is systemic. <laughs> the issue is systemic because the whole reason we have police departments in the first place, where did it stem from? What's our history going back to what Jeremy was talking about? What, where it was, what does it stem from? It stems from people in the South wanting to capture runaway slaves. Maybe they shouldn't be heroes. Maybe they don't belong on a kid's show. Uh, so I disagree with the, what Jeremy, Jeremy said about it, because uh, I think cops are heroes and they have to have a difficult job, but we have to have all of them. Life. Oh, I, I'm not, I mean, I'd say uh, a good majority of them. You have bad people in every business and every yet, part. Yeah. Well, wait, a wait, lot wait, of wait, wait, Police wait. officers have committed an atrocious crimes and have gotten away with it and have never been convicted of any of it. And, and I say this as a person who has family members who are police Thank, officers. Uh, yes, I, I, I understand. Um, and this is what I believe. This is my opinion. And this is, you know, not popular to say, but. Uh, I do support our police and we have bad people and the people that do bad things should be brought to justice. I agree with that. But I think that, uh, say, I'm saying it again. They haven't. Well, I agree with you on that point of they should, right? Okay, so what is and, your bottom line point? You're saying police officers should be revered, viewed as heroes. They belong I think on TV shows with children. I think children. they are heroes in a sense because they come to your need and they come and help you and they have a problem just like every other business, but we should fix that. But I think they're, they're heroes. Well, they're I think that's the problem. It's looking at it as a business. Because they're actually finish. supposed to protect and serve the people. They not do protect the us. What do we call when we're in trouble and someone has a knife or a gun? We I call wouldn't call the police. police. Why wouldn't you call the police? I don't trust them. My life's in oh. more who danger. Who would you call? In their presence. Professor, who would you call? I wouldn't call anybody. Well, would you have if someone intruded your house off. with a gun? What would you would you have a gun on you, or no. who would you call? It's my time to go. Okay, okay. Well, I'm not going to be not in your house with a gun. There's not much you can do at that point. Calling the police is kind of just you know. And I know that it's not popular for me to say that to you guys and, and people in here, but that's what I believe about the police. Okay, and, thank you. I appreciate um, it. Thank you, thank guys, you very much. for listening to my point. I appreciate it. Thanks. I will say, yeah, I'm glad you did say that, even if I disagree with you. It's important. Yeah, that, and we uh, should fight for the right for people to say things that we don't even like, right? I may not agree with what you say, but I'll fight for your right to say it. Amen, bro. Within some Amen. extent. I'll say. Anyone who is in any form of danger and has the ability to call 911 calls 911. This is the reason why modern feminism is the worst thing that could ever happen to womanhood for you. To have the audacity to come on a show and disregard authority because one or two bad apple hurt your feelings makes total, totally no sense. Teacher won't be teaching that class anymore, but he is back in it today. I think her argument was, uh, you know, she's more of a left wing person, and I think she was trying to get a gotcha moment out of me, and I just remained calm and respectful and gentle with her arguments and I think uh, she was trying to get that gotcha moment and to confuse me and just say oh I don't know she went on to tell you by the way that I feel more endangered by the police which is just statistically <laughs> in, in, insane it's a total lack of understanding of what the actual situation is in our country right now to, for her to even respond to the student a professor a professor responding to a student saying oh it does not matter even if um, uh, uh, I'm at gunpoint, it's fine. It's my time to go. Well, you make your bed, you lay on it just exactly as you made it.